your Precision 18 forecast. News 18, weather from where you live. We had a wave of snow showers earlier. Some of you did get a light fluffy dusting, but now a little bit of a loss. A lot of the snow showers are east and just south of the viewing area. We're getting some holes in the clouds here, but there are some additional snow showers upstream as this clipper kind of rounds the bend this way. Now you can see the greatest coverage of snowfall is here, and this is going to move like this. So the heaviest snow tonight is going to be southern Indiana, Kentucky, areas that received all the snow yesterday. But there are snow showers up in Iowa, Illinois, Wisconsin, and we will get these tonight and into tomorrow. But with that, the Arctic blast, very cold air coming in and a lot of wind to boot. Now tonight, 14 at 11 with a wind chill of 2 below zero, and then the winds gradually increase and the temperature goes down 6 by 7 a.m. with wind chills around 13 below zero. The scattered snow showers tonight and tomorrow, and that wind's just going to blow any of this fluffy, powdery, light snow around. Some of those gusts 30 to 40 miles an hour out of the northwest tomorrow. It'll be windy into tomorrow night and still pretty gusty even on Thursday. Now, in terms of snowfall, one inch or less, generally speaking, by tomorrow evening, one to two inches in our northeast. You head down south towards southern Indiana, one to two inches there. And then perhaps some snowfall a late Friday, Friday night, and into Saturday with some minor accumulation. But the temperature will start to warm up a little bit. Tonight, though, five Remington and Fowler, three Morocco, seven at Delphi, six for the low at Lafayette late, and down to 11 degrees at Kirkland. And then tomorrow, temperature rises to eight and then starts to fall slowly in the afternoon. Notice at 11 a.m., 15 below zero wind chill, eight degrees, six at 3 p.m., and then the wind chill is all the way down to 23 below zero by 7 p.m. with a temperature of two above. So these highs likely occurring in the morning, eight Delphi, 10 Frankfurt, 11 Covington, and about 10 degrees at New Richmond. And then tomorrow night, we really go downhill, one below zero at 11. And then by early on Thursday morning, check it out, we'll be around eight below zero with wind chills as low as 27 below. We might have a wind chill warning issue by the National Weather Service by tomorrow. Pretty amazing feat given the fact that we won't have necessarily a lot of snow on the ground. And these will be the lows, generally about 10 below to about four below zero, minus eight Lafayette, seven below at Dayton. Now we'll focus uh, get, get away from the cold and focus on the precip. Now, this is our precision future cast model. This is overnight. A few scattered snow showers around and still some scattered snow showers tomorrow. That's 1148. You can see those here and there around the area. That's about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And finally, these get out of here. We break the clouds up a little bit tomorrow night, and that's what will cause that temperature to really go down. One inch or less of snowfall accumulation by tomorrow evening, but one to two inches up towards Rochester, Denver, and Peru. And if you're driving south or towards Indianapolis, parts of southern Indiana, that area will get a one to two inch snow as well. Seven on Thursday, seven below zero Friday morning. Some light snow possible late Friday, Friday night into Saturday, but it does warm up to 31 Saturday. And then it just stays cold right for the rest of the weekend. I have only 22 Monday and perhaps some minor snowfall on Tuesday. So the normal high now, Jeff, is 39. Yeah. Way below that We're for the next normal. seven days. Morning coffee on the porch suspended yes, that's until right. further notice. Okay. All right, thanks, yep. Kip. Just ahead, a record number of guns confiscated at airport security checkpoints last year. We'll tell you the legal way to try.